Welcome to another thrilling comparison. Today, we delve into the world of armored warfare, bringing you a head-to-head -head comparison of India's Arjun main battle tank and China's Type 99A main battle tank. These two mechanized titans are the pride and power of their respective nations, symbolizing their strength and strategic prowess on the battlefield. In the grand theater of modern warfare, main battle tanks play a starring role. They are the armored knights of today, combining speed, firepower, and protection to dominate the battleground. Whether it's in the scorching deserts, the chilling tundra, or the dense urban landscapes, these war machines are designed to adapt, overcome, and conquer. Let's start with the Arjun main battle tank, a testament to India's technological ingenuity and military ambition. Developed by the Defense Research and Development Organization, the Arjun is a stalwart of the Indian Army. It's a tank that's been through the crucible of development and testing, emerging as a force to be reckoned with. On the other side, we have China's Type 99, a main battle tank, a product of China's rapid rise in the field of military technology. Developed by China North Industries Group Corporation, the Type 99A is the spearhead of the Chinese Armored Corps, boasting advanced features and formidable firepower. Both of these tanks are not just machines, but embodiments of their nation's resolve and capabilities. They are the result of decades of research, countless hours of engineering, and the unwavering dedication of countless individuals. They represent the strategic thinking, technological prowess, and military might of India and China. However, as much as they are similar, they are also different, each reflecting the unique challenges and strategic considerations of their countries. And these differences, these unique features and capabilities, are what we are here to explore today. So, are you ready to delve into the intricacies of these armored titans to understand their strengths, their weaknesses, and their strategic implications? Let's dive deeper into the details, shall we? The Arjun main battle tank, named after one of the fiercest warriors of Indian mythology, is a testament to India's technological prowess. At the heart of this hulking beast lies an impressive firepower. The Arjun MBT is fitted with a 120mm rifled gun which can fire a variety of ammunitions. This includes the APFSDS or Armor-Piercing Fin Stabilized Discarding Sabot which can penetrate even the toughest of enemy armor. The tank also boasts a coaxial machine gun and a remote-controlled anti-aircraft gun making it a versatile force on the battlefield. The Arjun's armor is another feature that sets it apart. The composite armor, combined with modular design, provides robust protection against all forms of attack. Furthermore, the tank is equipped with an advanced fire control system, which allows for accurate targeting even while on the move. In terms of mobility, the Arjun does not disappoint. Powered by a robust multi-fuel diesel engine, the tank can reach speeds of up to 70 km per hour on-road and 40 km per hour off-road. Its superior suspension system ensures a smooth ride, even in the roughest of terrains. However, it's not all roses and sunshine. The Arjun MBT does have its share of weaknesses. The tank's weight, for instance, has been a point of contention. At nearly 60 tons, the Arjun is one of the heaviest tanks in the world. This may limit its deployment in certain terrains and bridges not designed to bear such weight. The tank's electronic warfare capabilities are also worth mentioning. The Arjun is equipped with a state-of-the-art battlefield management system, enabling real-time information sharing between tanks. This system, coupled with advanced communication and night vision capabilities, puts the Arjun at the forefront of modern warfare. Now, let's turn our attention to the east and explore China's Type 99A. China's Type 99, a main battle tank, a symbol of the nation's rapid military modernization, stands as a formidable opponent. The Type 99A is a testament to China's technological prowess, a display of their commitment to military advancement. When it comes to firepower, the Type 99A does not disappoint. 
It's armed with a 125mm smoothbore gun capable of firing anti-tank guided missiles. The automatic loading system that the tank employs allows it to maintain a high rate of fire, keeping enemies on their toes. The armor of the Type 99A is equally impressive. With composite and modular reactive armor, it's designed to withstand a variety of threats. Its turret is encased in a sleek shell of composite armor, providing a high level of protection against kinetic and chemical energy attacks. In terms of mobility, the Type 99A is powered by a 1500 horsepower engine, giving it a top speed of around 80 kilometers per hour. This makes it one of the fastest main battle tanks in the world. Its agility allows it to quickly traverse difficult terrains, providing it with a tactical advantage on the battlefield. The Type 99A also shines in its electronic warfare capabilities. Equipped with a modern fire control system and advanced sensors, it has the ability to engage targets with high precision. The tank also includes a state-of-the-art communication system ensuring that it can effectively coordinate with other units in battle. However, the Type 99A is not without its weaknesses. The automatic loading system, while providing a high rate of fire, is prone to mechanical failures. Additionally, the tank's high speed can be a liability on tricky terrains, potentially leading to loss of control. So, we have laid out the details of both these armored beasts. But which one comes out on top? It's time to pit these titans against each other, analyzing their strengths and weaknesses side by side. The Arjun main battle tank, named after one of India's greatest warriors, has always stood for power and precision. Its German-made 120mm rifled gun, capable of firing a variety of ammunition, outperforms the Type 99A's 125mm smoothbore gun in terms of accuracy and range. The Arjun's Kanchan composite armor, developed indigenously, is reputed to be one of the toughest in the world, certainly giving it an edge in protection over the Type 99A. However, the Type 99A China's pride isn't without its own merits. Its advanced fire control system and ballistic computer, along with its ability to fire anti-tank guided missiles, provide it with a deadly first strike capability. In terms of speed and maneuverability, the Type 99A, being lighter, has a slight edge over the heavier Arjun. When we delve into operational experiences, the Arjun doesn't have any combat experience to speak of but it has performed exceptionally well in various trials and exercises. The Type 99A, on the other hand, has seen action in various theaters, giving it a tested and proven combat record. In terms of combat effectiveness, both tanks are formidable opponents. The Arjun, with its superior armor and gun, is a defensive powerhouse capable of holding ground and repelling enemy attacks. The Type 99A, with its advanced fire control system and first strike capability is an offensive juggernaut designed to spearhead assaults and break through enemy lines. But it's not just about the tanks. The modern battlefield is an intricate dance of combined arms where attack helicopters play a pivotal role. These airborne predators can strike from above, bypassing the heavy armor of the tanks. Both India and China have a formidable fleet of attack helicopters that can change the tide of a tank battle. So, it's clear that both the Arjun and the Type 99A are giants in their own right, each excelling in certain areas while having a few vulnerabilities. It's not just about who has the bigger gun or the thicker armor, but rather who uses their strengths more effectively. The moment of truth is upon us. Which tank takes the crown? Takes the... After a thorough comparison, it's time to declare a victor. Who takes the trophy? India's Arjun or China's Type 99A? We've delved deep into the intricacies of these mechanical behemoths. From their armor to their firepower and even their maneuverability. We've seen how the Arjun, with its advanced composite armor, and formidable 120mm rifled gun stands as a testament to India's technological prowess. It's a tank built for the rugged terrains of the subcontinent, with an emphasis on survivability and raw power. On the other hand, we've explored the Type 99A, 
China's answer to modern battlefield demands. Its blend of speed, advanced fire control systems, and formidable 125 mm of smoothbore gun make it a force to be reckoned with. It's a tank designed with an eye towards versatility and rapid response, a reflection of China's strategic outlook. Each tank, a symbol of its nation's military might and engineering capabilities, embodies a different approach to the same problem, how to dominate the battlefield. So, who comes out on top? The verdict is the Arjun main battle tank. While the Type 99A boasts impressive features, the Arjun edges it out in key aspects. Its superior armor and firepower, combined with its adaptability to the varied and challenging terrains of the Indian subcontinent, make it a slightly more formidable adversary. This is not to say that the Type 99A falls short. It's a reminder that the Arjun was built for the demands of India's specific battlefield needs. But let's not forget the crucial role of attack helicopters in modern warfare. They can sway the outcome of a battle, complementing the strengths and covering the weaknesses of these ground titans. It's a reminder to India to continue advancing its air capabilities as well. Remember, every tank has its day and the battlefield is always evolving. Until next time, keep your turrets high and your tracks steady.